John M. Bond. John M. Bond, I'm a security instructor yeah, here in uh, London, UK. Yeah. Uh, I wanted to, 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 to make a quick, uh, a quick video about uh, the job opportunities, job opportunities in uh, the private security sector here in, uh, in the UK. So uh, if you want to work in the private security sector, obviously, you need to be licensed. You need a license to work in, inside, inside the sector. Uh, what type of license are we talking about? There is a uh, different type of license that you can get from, from the SIA, from the SIA, the Security Industry Authority, that's the government uh, specialized in the private security sector, let's say. Uh, you, can, you can get, the, the, the first one would be uh, the security guard. So <clears throat> it's a basic license that will uh, open up uh, the doors and the opportunity to work in, in, in security uh, in uh, many areas, but this license has got its limitation. Yeah? Uh, for example, with this uh, security license, you can't work in a place where uh, 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 alcohol will be uh, uh, consumed, yeah? uh, like a pub or club, for example. But the, the, owner of, the holder of such a license can eventually work, uh, of course, in a retail, retail even though alcohol will be sold, but not consumed. Yeah? Uh, the next license will be the door, supervision, door supervisor license. Yeah? Uh, this one is a great one. This one, uh, with this license, you can do <coughs> pretty much every work that you wish in the private security sector, except uh, the close protection, uh, uh, close protection work. Yeah? Close protection work. Uh, this one, forget it. Yeah? The next license will be the CCTV. The CCTV is a good license to have. The CCTV is a very good license to have. Usually, uh, I would advise uh, my students uh, to try to get the two, the DS, the door supervision license, and the CCTV. Yeah? Same thing for the close protection, close protection, and CCTV. Uh, for example, I have personally, uh, myself, uh, I've got the close protection license and the CCTV on the top of or the other licenses that uh, I hold. Uh, we'll come next, cash and valuable, cash and valuable uh, in transit. Okay, that's uh, 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 the one who will move valuable goods, yeah? Uh, like we have some big names, like G4S, for example, yeah? Uh, then you will have, uh, on the top of the food chain, you will have uh, the close protection, the bodyguard license, yeah? Uh, if you live in Northern Ireland, uh, you will need, or if you want to work as a vehicle immobilizer, you will need a license for that. Yeah. So let's go back to those job opportunities. So when it comes to working in the private security sector, uh, right now, uh, today in uh, 2023, yeah, uh, 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 February, yeah, uh, there is a lot of work uh, available. Yeah. Uh, this is uh, the consequence of so many things, but the Brexit has something to do as well uh, with, with, with this, because the Brexit has created some kind of a vacuum, a big vacuum. And today we have a massive uh, 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 um, shortage, shortage of labor. So we don't have enough security officers to uh, fulfill all those uh, positions, yeah, which, is, uh, well, which is good for uh, the workers, yeah, because uh, today uh, we have uh, 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 one one worker or one officer for ten jobs, yeah, and not long ago it was another way around. So uh, as a worker, as an officer, uh, this will put you or put us in a pretty much pretty good situation, pretty good position, especially when it comes to uh, negotiate your rate. Uh, with your employer, yeah. Uh, so I would say that whoever uh, 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 wants to start in this private security sector, uh, let's say my new students will uh, will get their license and they will be looking for their first job, for their first job, yeah, uh, within the sector. Uh, there is many opportunities, but you need to be also uh, realistic. Uh, when it comes to, let's say, it will be easy for, uh, for, 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 for a new officer to start, for example, in a retail, in a retail world, yeah, 
uh, there is so many opportunities, opportunities you lose at it. Yeah? Uh, but this is not a job that will get them millionaire. Yeah? Uh, when it comes to the rates, the pay rates, uh, it's not the best that I have seen. Yeah? Uh, and also, the job is not easy. Uh, 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 the job is not that easy. There is so many challenges, yeah, uh, so many challenges, and you know you will have to deal with so many type of situation. Yeah, it could be anything. It could be uh, uh, you. You will have to deal with some homeless. You will have to deal with uh, specialist, uh, a specialist shoplifter. Yeah, uh, you will have to deal with. Uh, sometimes even your own colleagues, yeah, or your own staff could also be uh, a, a, a problem, yeah.